In this tutorial video, we'll guide you through the installation process of the Renogy Rover Series G2 Charge Controller. Whether you're new to solar energy or a seasoned DIY enthusiast, this video will help you set up your solar power system with ease. Inside the package, you'll find the Rover Charge Controller, a remote temperature sensor and mounting brackets. For added convenience, we recommend purchasing the BT2 Bluetooth module, allowing you to monitor the charging status right from your phone. Let's get started on simplifying your solar setup. First of all, connect the Rover Charge Controller to a 12 volts or 24 volts battery system. In this video, we'll use the 12 volts 100 amps core battery as an example. Use the tray cables to make the connection. Once you connect the battery, the charge controller will be turned on. Using the charge controller display, you can easily navigate through 11 key parameters. Simply use the up and down buttons to view system status, solar panel voltage, charging current, state of charge, battery voltage, load current, accumulated amp hours, discharged amp hours, ambient temperature, load mode, and any error codes. The secondary step is to set the battery type. The controller can charge sealed, gel, flooded, and lithium batteries. To change the battery type, highlight the main menu screen, press and hold the right arrow button until the battery type screen shows up. The default setting is SEL or sealed. After reaching the screen, press the down arrow button to cycle between the four battery options, and then long press the right arrow button to save the battery type. Next, connect the temperature sensor included in the package to the labeled port on the controller. Place the sensor inside the battery compartment, or tape it to the side of the battery for accurate temperature monitoring. Next, connect the BT2 Bluetooth module to the charge controller. The Renogy Rover G2 Charge Controller features enhanced wiring for improved strength and reliability. With its upgraded Bluetooth connection interface from 232 rupees to 485 rupees, the Bluetooth connection is now more stable and offers longer range. Once connected, you can conveniently monitor the charging status and adjust parameters directly through the DC Home app. The final step is to connect the solar panel. We will use this adapter kit to connect the panel to the rover. Once the panel is connected, the PV voltage will be shown on the LCD screen. We hope this video has helped you with the Rover Charge Controller installation. 